Morning, Governor Andy Bashir signed an executive order to ban the use of conversion therapy on minors in Kentucky. He says the practice, which tries to change a person's sexual orientation or gender identity through counseling, is harmful to children. WKYT's Mariah Congito was there as the order was signed and has more from both sides of that issue. Our top story at 430. To me, it's not even about gender or sexuality. It's about protecting our youth from an inhumane practice that hurts them. Governor Andy Bashir cited various psychologists and mental health providers in his speech, saying conversion therapy has no basis in medicine and no basis in science. Today's action does not force an ideology on anybody. It does not expose anyone to anything in a library or a school. It simply stops a so-called therapy that the medical community says is wrong. Governor Bashir says the ban effective immediately will do two things, prohibit state and federal funds to pay for conversion therapy and will ensure professionals who attempt to deliver this care are appropriately sanctioned by their licensing board. We know the best thing we can do as mental health providers is to affirm the identity of the kids in our care. Bashir says research has shown that such therapy leads to increased risk of suicide, anxiety and depression. Supporters in the room, including members of the Fairness Campaign and conversion therapy survivors, praised Bashir for taking such action. As Governor Bashir was signing the executive order as a pledge to fight for every citizen, the room was met with opposition. What this is perpetuating is this lie and the, the ideology uh, that someone can be something different from their biological sex. God has made us a certain way, and, and we need to come to conformity with that. Jerry Doris and Tim Tyso say this order denies the First Amendment by silencing anyone who would offer a different and perhaps more beneficial path to a child. We believe children are being harmed by, by the truth being kept from them. Mariah Congito, WKYT. And uh, further details uh, now on this, Governor Bashir says he is still hoping to get legislation passed by the General Assembly on that topic.